NATO Secretary General Mark Rutte visited a battlegroup exercise called Resolute Warrior in Latvia on Thursday. Ruta was there to promote European defense spending and production of military supplies. Ruta said that 2% defense spending by NATO allies is insufficient. It is simply not enough, he stressed, urging members of the Transatlantic Alliance to spend more during a joint press conference with Latvia President Edgars Rinkiewicz. Currently, some 3,500 Allied troops are training at Adatsi military base in Latvia as part of Resolute Warrior. In my view, there will be a couple of big issues we need to debate over the coming months. Of course, first of all, we have to make sure that Ukraine prevails and that Putin will not win in Ukraine. That is absolute priority number one. But behind that, there are two other big issues at stake. One is that 2%, when you take out the U.S. spending, we are now at 2% in Europe as NATO. It is simply not enough, as the President just was saying. It is simply not enough. So we will need to have the debate on spending more. And another big issue is defense production. We are not producing enough at this moment. We have to do more to replenish our stockpiles, uh, to make sure that we are ready to face off any adversary. So these two issues, defense spending and defense production, and all of this working with our partners, the EU, but also in the Indo-Pacific, including Japan, South Korea, Australia, New Zealand, the southern neighborhood, this is crucial. The, the United States is an integral part of NATO. They have founded the alliance. They are not into NATO because of some historical reason that they didn't want to repeat the mistake after the First World War. Uh, not to repeat the mistake after the Second World War. They know that this is an integral part of their defense, of our defense, our collective defense. And sometimes we talk about frontline states. Let me make absolutely clear, the Netherlands and France and the United Kingdom are frontline states. Uh, we are there together with the Baltics, Poland, all the other member states of NATO. We are all frontline states. There is not a, a, a frontline state which is closer to Russia or farther away from Russia. And we need the U.S. and the U.S. needs us, we need each other to work on this. It was Trump who, from 2016 onwards, was pushing us on this part of NATO to spend more on defense. Look what's happening on Latvia, moving up to north of 3.5%. Uh, overall, EU, NATO now at 2%, and we need to do more. We need to ramp up industry production. So on all of this, we need the U.S., the U.S. needs us. We are together in NATO, all for one, one for all. President-elect Donald Trump on Tuesday said Elon Musk and former GOP presidential candidate Vivek Ramaswamy will lead a new Department of Government Efficiency, which is not, despite the name, a government agency. The acronym DOGE is a nod to Musk's favorite cryptocurrency, Dogecoin. Trump said in a statement that Musk and Ramaswamy will work from outside the government to offer the White House advice and guidance, and will partner with the Office of Management and Budget to drive large-scale structural reform and create an entrepreneurial approach to government never seen before. He added that the move would shock government systems. It's not clear how the organization will operate. It could come under the Federal Advisory Committee Act which dictates how external groups that advise the government must operate and be accountable to the public. Federal employees are generally required to disclose their assets and entanglements to ward off any potential conflicts of interest, and to divest significant holdings relating to their work. Because Musk and Ramaswamy would not be formal federal workers, they would not face those requirements or ethical limitations. Musk posted on X, Department of Government Efficiency. The merch will be. Later he added, threat to democracy? Nope, threat to bureaucracy. Musk has been a constant presence at Mar-a-Lago since Trump won the presidential election. The president-elect has often said he would give Musk a formal role overseeing a group akin to a blue ribbon commission that would recommend ways to slash spending and make the federal government more efficient. Musk at one point suggested he could find more than $2 trillion in savings, nearly a third of total annual government spending. Ramaswamy suspended his campaign in January and threw his support behind Trump. Where is he? Come on up here, Elon. He created the first major 
American car company in generations and his rocket company is the only reason we can now send American astronauts into space. Come here. Take over, Elon. Just take over. <laughs> As you can see, I'm, I'm, I'm not just MAGA, I'm Dark MAGA. You know, you... you you, 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 show, you, show, you, show what, you show what matters by your actions, not your words. And my actions are: I'm here, I'm in Pennsylvania, um, and I'm here for a very important reason. Which, yeah, it, it which is. I can't emphasize. I can't emphasize enough that Pennsylvania is, I think, the linchpin in this election, and this election, I think, is going to decide uh, the fate of America. And in, uh, along with the fate of America, the fate of uh, Western civilization. I think as a nation, we are really still just a little young, actually. And I think we can still be a nation in our ascent. So on one hand, I'm not going to be the person who tells you it's morning in America because it's not. But I think it can be. And I think it's going to take a leader who both sees the present hour for what it is. The hour is late, but it's not done yet. And I think with that, I do think that our nation's best days for the next generation can still be ahead of us. I think, a, I think right now, uh, if we're meaningfully above where the mainstream media narrative has us polling or otherwise, if, we're, if we score in the double digits, I think we're well on our way to success. And I think that we are absolutely going to achieve that. And I think that there's plenty of room for a top three, top two, or even a top one finish on the table for us right now. Yeah. 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 Ready to go? Finish your workout? Let's do it, brother. 30. Yeah. Let's go, Babette. Yeah. 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30